A view from the sideline and a view from the top of the SEC. A view from the top 10 in the country, surely. A view of Riley Mattingly displaying that Alabama name across her jersey again. 2-0, Bama over South Carolina. Riley Mattingly joins us here in post game on a Thursday night primetime extravaganza in Tuscaloosa. You pointed to your jersey when you scored. You pointed to it right after you took that photo. Your teammates are around you a moment ago. Wes Hart described the win at BYU as validation, said this would be a statement. What does this win mean to Alabama soccer? I mean, it's, it's exactly that. It's a statement. Uh, Time and time again this season, we've continued to prove ourselves. And I think time and time again, the more challenges that come up, we're going to answer those challenges. We showed tonight, we showed against Clemson, we showed against BYU. It was a heck of a win, exciting. Sorry if I'm breathing hard in the mic right now. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, it was awesome. Exactly that, it was, it was a statement. And we're going to continue to make those all season long. Riley, we didn't see you last year. You've come back guns a blazing. This is the best form I've ever seen you in. What have you been up to? Oh man, I've been grinding for sure. <laughs> um, I'm in. A, I stayed in Alabama all summer uh, last year to to try and get back for the season. Unfortunately, that wasn't in the cards for me. So uh, I just knew that I was going to do everything I could to give it all, give it all to my teammates, to the program, to to Wes. Um, so I've been I've been working hard, and I've had I've been surrounded by great teammates that continue to push me every day. So they definitely make me better. And I'm just happy to be here. I've, I've been working hard and we've all been working hard. So it's not just me, it's, it's, it's a different team this year. So it's been awesome. Riley has scored the 59th minute of this game and, and the joy with which you celebrate was notable. Can you try and put in perspective what this goal means given all you've been through with the knee injury in 2021 and just getting back on the field and feeling that joy again? You just can't, you just, you can't even describe it. I, like I was, I was talking to my dad today, just all day, I, I just say, I hate waiting for the game to get here. You just have these butterflies and just knots in your stomach and how are you gonna perform today? You gotta sit around and, and then it all builds up in the tension and the final whistle blows and all that goes away. And so, and then I knew, I, I knew I was gonna score today. I had a feeling, uh, I'm starting to question if I can score with my feet, um, but. <laughs> But I mean, it's it's indescribable. It's awesome, and then to be surrounded by such a great crowd and great teammates, it's it's unlike anything you can even put into words. It's like fireworks everywhere. <laughs> Riley, this team seems different. There's an appetite to press. There's an appetite to keep the ball and create quality goal scoring opportunities. A belief, a hunger. What what is the X factor surrounding Alabama women's soccer program right now? I think it's the it's the culture that Wes has created here. Um, I've, I've said this before and I'll say it again. I've, I've known him since, I, since 2015. When I committed here, uh, the, way, the way he got me here was let's do two things. Let's build a culture, let's build a program and let's win a championship. So I think we've done the first thing and now we're looking to do the second thing. And I think that's the X factor, the culture, the culture here and then the championship hopefully is gonna take care of itself. Riley, congratulations. I think you guys probably minted a few new Alabama soccer fans here in Tuscaloosa tonight. <laughs> I sure hope so. They help us out. And uh, congratulations on, on the marriage. All the best to you and John. Uh, thank you. Appreciate it. I like those pictures. They, they're, they're really good. They're good. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Congratulations. Appreciate it. Riley Mattingly Parker joining us here post game on SEC Network as number 11, Alabama defeats number five, South Carolina.